What's up, guys? This is Chris from DraftDashboard.com. Here are my DFS picks for NBA Thursday, November 21st. These picks apply for DraftKings and FanDuel. Before I get started, please drop a like on this video and hit that red subscribe button and hit that bell icon so you don't miss our new videos. In this video, I'm gonna go over my top picks for today's NBA slate. And if you stick around to the very end of this video, we'll use the Draft Dashboard tools to make a DFS lineup using the picks we just made. Okay, who do we have at the point guard position? I like George Hill from the Milwaukee Bucks playing the Portland Trailblazers who have the fourth worst defense overall and give up the fourth most fantasy points to opposing point guards. George Hill has averaged 19.9 fantasy points per game on the season playing an average of 23 minutes per game with a 14% usage rate. He's projected at 21.7 fantasy points here tonight that's 5.4 times value. He's 4,000 DraftKings salary and 400 more on FanDuel. Vegas thinks there's going to be 231 points scored in this game. So we got a high scoring game, a fast paced game, and a great matchup. So I like George Hill here versus the Portland Trailblazers. Before I continue with the picks, I'm excited today because we added a new contest for everyone watching. If you want to enter the drawing for $100 PayPal, all you need to do is like this video, hit that subscribe button, and make a quick comment below to be entered into the drawing. We'll reply to a random comment and let you know that you won, and then we'll send you $100 PayPal. So it's that easy, and we pick a new winner every Saturday and announce them in our video. So get your comment in now so I can add another entry for you. Okay, let's take a look at the shooting guard position. With no Damian Lillard tonight, I like CJ McCollum from the Portland Trailblazers playing the Milwaukee Bucks, who have a middle of the pack defense overall, and they've been pretty good against opposing shooting guards, but CJ McCollum has scored 35.2 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 37 minutes per game. He scored 42, 41, and 54 fantasy points in the last three games with a 26% usage rate. Projected at 36.3 fantasy points here tonight. That's 4.8 times value. I think he scores over 40 fantasy points here and gets over five times value. He's 7,500 DraftKings salary in the same price on FanDuel. So we know Vegas thinks there's gonna be 231 points scored in this game high scoring game so I like CJ McCollum here versus the Milwaukee Bucks okay guys if you're getting any value from this video please hit that red subscribe button we put out new fantasy basketball videos every single day so if you hit that subscribe button and ring that bell notification you won't miss out on any of our new fantasy basketball and fantasy football videos. Tons of free stuff coming your way. It only takes a second and it helps us push out more fantasy content for you guys to consume each and every day. It's because of you subscribers that make this possible. So thank you for supporting this channel. Okay, let's take a look at the small forward position. I like Kent Bazemore from the Portland Trailblazers playing the Milwaukee Bucks. Kent Bazemore has averaged 20.1 fantasy points per game on the season in an average of 24 minutes per game with an 18% usage rate. He scored 21 fantasy points in 28 minutes last game. He's projected at 25.8 fantasy points here tonight. That's six times value. He's 4,300 DraftKings salary and 100 less on FanDuel. So we've only got a two game slate tonight. So you're gonna have multiple players from the same game. I think Portland is a good team to stack with Damian Lillard out. So I like Kent Bazemore here versus the Milwaukee Bucks. Okay, who do we have at the power forward position? I like Frank Kaminsky from the Phoenix Suns playing the New Orleans Pelicans who have the fifth worst defense overall, and they give up the fourth most fantasy points to opposing power forwards. Frank Kaminsky has averaged 
22.2 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 24 minutes per game. He scored 25 fantasy points in 23 minutes last game. He's averaging 20% usage rate, projected at 25.2 fantasy points here tonight. That's 5.5 times value. He's 4,600 DraftKings salary and the same price on FanDuel. Vegas thinks there's going to be 235 points scored in this game, so another high scoring game. This is a home game, a fast paced game, and a great matchup, so I like Frank Kaminsky here versus the New Orleans Pelicans. Real quick guys, I got great news. For a limited time, we're offering a full 30 day trial to Draft Dashboard. You can try all of our DFS tools for all sports. You can try the position optimizer where you can see the top players ranked for each position. And we added a new player trends tool where you can see the top salary differences between FanDuel and DraftKings. It's a really good tool to help you pick out value for the site that you're playing on. Oh, and if you're tired of doing research every day, we just added a cheat sheet that shows hand-picked plays for the slate. No confusing stat lines, no headaches, just a simple cheat sheet that shows the absolute best players for your lineups. Okay, moving on to the center position. I like Brooke Lopez from the Milwaukee Bucks playing the Portland Trailblazers, who have the fourth worst defense overall, and they give up the fifth most fantasy points to opposing centers. Brooke Lopez has averaged 26.9 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 27 minutes per game with an 18% usage rate. He scored 29, 50, and 38 fantasy points in the last three games, so he's on fire. Projected at 27.5 fantasy points here tonight, that's 5.1 times value. He's 5,400 DraftKings salary and 1,400 more on FanDuel. This is a home game, a fast paced game, and a great matchup. So I like Brooke Lopez here versus the Portland Trailblazers. If you wanna try all these daily fantasy tools for yourself, click the link in the description below this video or just go to draftdashboard.com. You can use our DFS lineup optimizer to build quality lineups using our picks and your own custom player pool. Click the link in the description below this video and try all these daily fantasy tools right now. Thanks so much for watching. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit that bell icon so you can get instant updates whenever we post a new video. Thank you so much for watching everyone. If you enjoyed this video, please smiggity smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Oh, and please comment below with your favorite player for this NBA slate. I love to hear what you guys have to think. Thanks again and good luck. Do you want more fantasy picks? Check out the video linked right in the middle of the screen. If you got any value from this video, please tap that subscribe button before you get out of here and ring that bell notification so you won't miss our daily fantasy football uploads. We're putting out new videos every day, so I don't want you guys to miss any of our free content.